hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to fix when ea app is not launching on your windows computer now the first step is to close ea process in task manager and then try to launch ea app so make a right click on the start menu and then go to task manager and then go to the process tab and then if you find ea over here make a right click and then click on end task again look for ea you can scroll down and find if you find any ea service running make a right click and then click on end task once you close all the ea process then you can launch the ea app and then you can check now still you are unable to launch ea app in, in that case the next step is to run ea app as an administrator now for this you can just type in ea app in windows search box make a right click on ea app and then click on run as administrator so try opening ea app as an, as an administrator still not working the next step is to start ea background service now for this type in services in windows search box and then click on services and then find ea background service make a double click on ea background service and make sure startup type is set to automatic click on apply now if start is highlighted in my case it's already running so if start is highlighted click on start and then you can try to launch ea app and then check still not working next step is to run ea app updater now for this type in ea app in windows search box make a right click on ea app and then click on open file location now here you can see ea app updater make a double click and then click on yes and let it complete if there is any update it will update it and then you can check next step is to clear ea app cache now for this make a right click on ea app once again and then click on open file location make a right click on app recovery over here and then click on run as administrator open app recovery as an administrator click on yes to allow and then you will see clear cache option click on it and this will relaunch the ea app and then you can check next step is to repair ea app so still it's not working in that case you can type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel and then click on uninstall a program and then find ea app in the list now once you find ea app make a right click on ea app and then click on uninstall click on yes and once you click on uninstall okay first of all close ea app in my case ea app was running make sure that you close ea app and then you can make a right click on ea app and then click on uninstall now after this do not uninstall click on a repair option and this process will take uh, some time maybe a few minutes and once ea app is installed and once the repair is complete then you can launch ea app and then check still not working the next step is to update windows to the latest version now this is important so open windows settings go to windows update or update and security and then click on check for update once all the updates are installed over here then restart your computer and after the system restart you can launch ea app and then check now the next step is to uninstall and reinstall ea app so if nothing is working next step is to uninstall and reinstall ea app now for this you can close ea app it's already it's not running so you can just type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel and then click on uninstall a program select ea app and then make a right click on ea app and then click on uninstall and this time click on uninstall now once the uninstall is complete restart your computer and then you can go to ea app website go to ea app and then you can download the latest version of ea app over here windows and then you can run this exe file now still ea app is not launching in that case the last step is to close all third party applications so if you have any third party application running close it make sure that you close it from the task manager also close all the background application whichever whatever services are running in the background so you can just close all the third party application and software 
perform clean boot now for this type in system configuration in windows search box and then go to system configuration go to the services tab and then put a check on the box which says hide all microsoft services make sure that you put a check on hide all microsoft services first and then click on disable all and then click on apply click on ok you will see a restart option click on restart and after the system restart you can launch the ea app and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to get the EA app working. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.